Good morning, guys. Hey, today I am back out in Central PA. I am on the little J again. Okay. <laughs> it's just a smidge under 400, a little high, a little off color. Saw a couple fish rise. They were kind of a splashy rise. I think it's Caddis. I actually saw a Hendrix. I didn't know they had a Hendrix in it, but it was definitely a Hendrix and flying around. And um, uh, I'm up in fairly shallow water. Um, I don't know exactly how it is. It looks like it's about a foot and a half to two foot deep. And um, so today I'm going to be using, like I did last time I was here, I got a Frenchie. I'm not using my brown uh, hair's ear soft tackle. I got my um, uh, GSS Emerger, the soft tackle. And then I have um, uh, a GSS Emerger. And then I have a regular Caddis. Well, a soft tackle, but it's got an olive body, okay? I'm kind of on the light olive side, light olive body, because I have seen some Caddises flying around too. So, um, I got an indicator on. Um, I'm going to try it at first, but I just saw a fish rise down here. Caddises, I usually do okay catching stuff on the swing, and um, but I don't like to have the indicator on when I'm when I'm swinging my flies because the indicator flops around on top of the water and kind of screws up, you know, me checking to see if I have a hit or not. Um, so, I don't know. I'll try it out at first, but I might take the indicator off. Okay, so, um, and if a hatch comes off, some fish start rising, I'll switch over to drive because I really would love to start catching them on top. Okay. Um, I got a dry fly fishing, a dry fly fishing video coming out. I did it. I was on the Tully. And um, don't know if I'm going to put that one out before this one, vice versa, I don't know yet. But be on the lookout for that dry fly fishing video, okay? Um, okay, so let's get started. I'll show you my first couple casts. The reason I'm using an indicator is because there's a pretty good glare out here. And um, ah, picking up my line... And it's like a whole field of <laughs> just glare and ripply water. I love the ripply water, but it's just sometimes hard to pick up my line. So I'm just using the indicator at first, okay? This is one of the uh, airflow indicators. And um, so we'll try this. Let me get right on the edge here. And definitely going to let it swing today. Just let it hang down there. Okay. It's a fluorescent orange indicator I'm using. I'm only using 5X. I kind of did the wrong thing. I like, love using 4X when I'm nymphing, especially with some of these big fish on the J, but I tied on a long 5X tippet, thinking that I was going to be fishing on top, and I'm not. But I didn't want to waste the leader or stuff it somewhere. So I said, okay, I'll keep the 5X on. Just heard another one rise down there. <laughs> Got one here. I saw one rise right down in front of me. I swung it right in front of him. And man, he whacked it. I took off with my drag. There he goes. Oh man. I don't even know which one he's on. Let's see. Okay. I 
nice fish. I don't know, he's on the last fly, he's on my soft tackle. And that's the olive one. Okay. There he is. Come on, buddy, come on, buddy, come on, buddy. There you go. Oh, man, look at that. Good 14, 15 inches. Woohoo! Way to start the day. Okay. Oh, my God. Beauty, beauty, beauty. Okay. I am going to take that indicate. Well, ah. huh. I'll keep it on just for a little bit longer, the indicator. Okay, let me show you my flies. Just got my line here. Okay. We have got uh, in my finger the Frenchie. We have got the GSS. Okay. GSS Emerger soft tackle. And this is the boy I got him on. Olive soft tackle. Okay, so um, like I said, I saw that one rise, swung it right in front of him. Um, I saw one rise down a little, but I, I don't know. We'll, we'll see here. I'll show you just a couple casts here again. If I see a riser, I'll turn the camera back on and try to swing it right in front of the riser. Just gonna let this hang down there. See, when I have that indicator on, it just flops on top of the water. It's kind of hard for me to see a strike or detect a strike on the swing with that thing flopping around down there. Let's swing this in the calmer water. Another one. I didn't see this fish rise. This boy just took it on the swing, just letting it hang down there. Man, these fish are hitting this current and just taking me, taking drag off, ripping drag. Man, man, man. Oh, got off. Ah. Ah. Oh, well. Let me check my flies, make sure they're okay. <sighs> yep, I'm working my way across, and then I'm going to go down, I don't know, eight yards, come back across, go down, go across. As, as, as like, depending on how deep the water is. Okay, so that flies okay. That flies okay. And that flies okay, okay? So all of them are okay. He must have just been barely hooked. Hey guys, I got a little one here, but this is the third one I got on the swing. And third one on that same olive soft tackle. Okay. There we go. Little guy, he was about eight inches. Hey guys, <laughs> I'm three for five. And um, had a real nice fish break me off down here. I was using 5X, so I switched back over to 4X, tied another rig on. And um, well, I'll show you my first couple casts, okay? Starting all over again. And that was on the swing, man. He just, ba boom! Had him hooked for like two seconds, and that was it. It's behind this rock, so it might have been that one that I saw rise earlier. I saw a fish rise over closer to shore, and um, we'll see how that goes.
And these fish on the little J, they do not play games. <laughs> there he goes, there he goes, on the swing. There he goes, bang. Wow. Look at that, that was just at the start of the swing. I actually even threw it downstream a little. Man, he ripped it. Man, Man he ripped it. So I feel a little bit more better with 4X on. Got that one on film for you. Yeehaw. <laughs> okay. So let's get this boy in, hopefully, and get me up to 500. There he is, so. I, mean, I don't know what he's on yet. I see my glow bug. So he's either on the pheasant tail or the soft tackle again. Thank God I tied up a bunch of them. Okay, let's see if I can get them in. Okay. Get them up here, stand for Nice fish, nice fish. Come on, fishy. Keep them in there, keep them to the side. Get them out of that fast water. Bring them in. The he is on the soft tackle again. Nice fish. Okay. Good, good 14. Good 14 inches. Okay. On that soft tackle. Okay. Okay, show you that soft tackle. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Get him out of my net. Okay. And there he is. Got a little shuck on it. Got a little gold rib. Last one I had didn't have a gold rib. Okay. So. Hey guys, I got a decent one on here. I just hooked one. Only had him on about five seconds. Got off. I threw back over there and I hooked this guy. The one that I lost was about 12 inches. This one feels bigger than 12. So. <laughs> Let's get this boy in. At least. Let's get this boy in here. And that was right up against the bank. Right up against the bank. Can't see him, he's staying deep. So I think he's on the soft tackle. Uh-oh. Going out there. Try to keep him. Come on, buddy. Nice fish, nice fish, nice fish. Nice fish. That's like a good 15-16. Okay. Come on over here, buddy. Come on over here. Oh, come on. Yep, he's on the soft tackle. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Oh, there he goes. That's okay. That's okay. Hey guys, I got a nice one. I got this guy just nymphing. Oh, he's a good 15, 16 inches. I gotta walk. Around this guy. Let's try to keep him on. Let's see. To get him up. Keep him down low. Okay. Didn't feel big at first, and then he took a big jump. Come on, buddy. 
Get you over here. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. I don't know what he's on yet. Ah, I put on the hare's ear soft tackle. You whack that one. Okay. Nice fish. No, oh, he's not that big. Oh, wow. Well, he's 14 at least. Yeah, he's at least 14. Okay. Looked bigger when he jumped. Haha. <laughs> okay. And there's the hairs your soft hat, I'll show you. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay guys, there's a nice area right here. Oh god, boy, just stand there talking to you. He hit it while I was just hanging there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Is that something? I'm talking to you guys, let my thing have, look at it, a little guy. He came up to the surface, a super fast water this little teeny tiny trout's in. <laughs> That's pretty cool. <laughs> look at this little guy. That's seven inches. <laughs> That's something. <laughs> well, thank you, that little fish, because you at least put me up at 500, um, batting 500. That's five for ten. <laughs> I had five of them get off. But that's pretty par for the course for the J for me. Um, hey guys, I changed my whole rig up. Um, I put my indicator back on. I have, let me show you, a catnip on. I have one split shot right there. Then I have catnip okay then I have this is called the J-bug this is uh, Eric Stroop's guide fly the J-bug basically like I'm just an olive nymph okay and then a caddis bubble pupa okay and uh, so we're just gonna nymph right now there are a couple little sulfurs coming off right now I saw a couple fish rising for caddis, big splashy rises, but they did not take my offering. So, so we're just going to go nymphing after these guys and see what see what happens. Show you a couple drifts here. Oh, oh, there he goes. There he goes. Oh, nice one. Nice one. Nice one. It's a nice big fish. Man, he's all the way out there. Keep him down. Man, he wrecked it. Kind of curious to see which one he's on. Bring him all the way back in. There's my indicator. Gee, that was only a couple drifts with a new rig. Okay, let's see where he's at. Man, he is shaking his head. He is angry. Nice fish. See if we can get him up here. There he is. Oh, he saw me. Going to take off. 
Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Oh, get him away from that log. Just heard a fish jump. Oh, nice fish. Nice fish. He is on the J-Bug. He is on the J-Bug. How about that? Okay, it's about a size 14. Oh, there you go, man. Big, big, heavy fish. 16 inches. Heavy, heavy fish. Look at that. Okay. Beautiful. Easy 16 inches. Okay. Hey guys. I got a big fish on here. Man, he is big. But he is not, he's not, I don't know why he's not fighting. He's coming right into me. I think he's going to go nuts though once he sees me. He's not on the cat. I don't know what he's on. Oh, man. Uh, uh, uh. He came up to the surface. Oh, 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 oh. Now he's going nuts, though. Now he's going nuts, though. Man, I hooked him. He didn't budge. I thought it was a snag. Then he came to the surface and splashed. Just, Ooh, that's a big fish. But he's just kind of slowly just swimming around the stream. <laughs> he, uh, he's deep, so he... I think he's on a pheasant tail. I got the J-bug on. And then the pheasant tail. But he's pretty deep. I can't see him. Ooh. I can't see him yet. Man, he looked big. Oh, is that a sucker maybe? Maybe that's why he's fighting like that. Might be a sucker. I'm not too sure yet. What is it? Is it a sucker? That's big. Oh no, that's a big trout. That looks like a rainbow. Hoo, hoo, hoo. But he's not fighting like a rainbow. Oh man. Come on, let's hold this guy. He's tw 20 inches. Oh my gosh. He is big. Oh my, he's over 20 inches. He might be 22, 23 inches. Oh my gosh. I caught one here last year that was 26 inches. He was like, <laughs> had to be eight pounds. He was just a monster, probably out of Spruce Creek. And this guy, Oh my gosh. Come on, buddy. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at how big that fish is. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Keep him away from all the... Just keep him in the stream. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look how big this boy is. Oh my gosh. 
My biggest fish on the J. Oh no, that one last year was the biggest fish. But this one's. Oh my gosh, this sucker's big. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, come on, buddy. Very light colored. There he is. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I'm up. I can't get any further. I'm up to my. There he is. Come here, buddy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Jeez, man, he's so heavy. He's like four pounds. Actually hurting. Come on, swimming. Man, he is just so heavy. Come on. Oh my gosh. Come on. Come on. I gotta get this guy in a little further. Come on, I'm trying to fight him. So careful. Oh my gosh. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on, get him over here. He's got to be tiring out soon. Trying so hard to bring him in. Come on, come on, man. Jeez, I cannot get him in. Oh my gosh, he is on that little pheasant tail, size 18. He's got to be 25 inches. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Big. Oh my gosh. On a size 18 pheasant tail. Oh my gosh. Oh. Calm him down. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He's got to be 25 inches. Two foot. He's 24. I don't know about 25. Mm -mm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. 
Oh God. No, a big rainbow. Okay guys, there he is. I'm gonna get him off to the side, put him back in the water, and help him go off. Oh my gosh, look at him. Oh my god. Fuck like that. <laughs> oh my god. Let him sit down there and recover. Oh my gosh. Okay guys. Now I got a normal size fish. <laughs> Around 12 inches. Oh my gosh. My arm can handle that one. I couldn't handle another big one. <laughs> Let's get this guy in here. Okay. There we go. Let's just bring him in. He is on the J bug. He's around 11 inches. So there's that J bug. Basically just an olive nymph. Okay, that's a big though. It's about a size 12, 14. And then I got that big monster rainbow on my yellow lively legs with my hot spot UV shrimp thorax uh, pheasant tail. <laughs> size 18, unbelievable. Okay. I got this one. Wow, that <laughs> fish jumped far out there. Got this one long distance nymphing at the beginning of the swing. So I'm curious to see what he's on. Uh, see what he's on. Uh, get my net. Get my net. Get my net. There he is. Nice. 11, 12 inches. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Okay, go. He is on the. I still don't know. I think he's on the J bug. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I don't know. More like 11. But there's that J bug again. Okay, just an olive nymph. Big olive nymph. Okay, dark olive too. Guys, got one here in the rifts again. <sighs> okay, curious to see what he's on. Decent fish, decent fish. Man, he's fighting. Man, he is fighting. I keep him down in the water. He is a fighter. Shaking that head, man. Shaking his head. I haven't seen him yet. Let's see what he looks like. Ooh, nice fish. Nice fish, nice fish. Uh -oh, somebody's shooting a gun. I think he's going to take another run for it. Let's see. Ooh, nice fish. Oh, my God. 
Look at this fish. Oh my gosh. Look at this fish. He's on. Let's see this fish. Oh my gosh. Come here, buddy. Keep him in the water. Keep him in the water. Oh, he's out there now. He is on the pheasant tail again. Come here. Oh, look at that. 17. Easily 17, maybe 18 inches. 17 probably, though. He yeah, is 17. Oh, my gosh. On the pheasant tail. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. There's a pheasant tail as well. There you go. Nice. Oh, my gosh. There you go. Okay. Come on, bud. Come on, Oh, look at that guy. Oh, look at that guy. Oh, my God. There you go. Beautiful. Okay, guys. I left that area down there. I'm going to hit the faster water up here. Okay. Uh, nothing happening on the surface down there at all. I was hoping, wishing... I'm praying that there be some surface activity, but there's not. So let's just stick with nymphing and nymph where the nymphs are. Okay. Show you a couple casts here. Some fresh water. fish up here in this section even in my last video but I never really kill up here so maybe something will be different today oh look at that something will be different today <laughs> there you go there you go that's a nice fish He's fighting, he's fighting, man. He wants to go. He wants to go, he wants to go. Okay, man. Let's see what he's on. Nice, nice fish. There you go. He's angry. Man, he's angry. Nice fish. I think I got room above me. Let's get him up here. Let's see which one he is on. He is oh nice fish. Man, that's look at that. Oh my gosh, it's a good 17. Good 17, maybe even 18. Man, that fish is long. He is on the uh pheasant tail. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Uh -uh 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 -uh. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> Man, he wanted to go. He was angry. That. Okay, let me see here. I won't tangle up, but 
That is all my pheasant tail. Oh man, yeah, I put on a new one. <laughs> he chewed up that. He ate, he ate one of my lively legs. <laughs> okay, let me fix my rig up. Wow, we feel good about this little section I'm gonna be going into right now. So, see if I could get something on film for you again. <clears throat> That, uh, uh, pheasant tail that I took off was an 18 hook, but it was 1x long, like a nymph hook. The one I put on is an 18, but it's a regular 18, so it's a slightly shorter body. I, I hope it being just slightly smaller doesn't take away from it. Um, I don't have one that size. Well, I do, but I was trying to keep the yellow legs. I have brown legs, um, but I was trying to keep the yellow legs. I have hare's ears, fairly dark hare's ears tied up with the yellow legs that size. Or maybe I'll switch over to that if this doesn't produce for me. But I think it should. Hmm. Go right in this pocket right here. Right there, come on, whack it. Whack it, whack it, whack it. Oh, there should be a fish in there. There should be a fish in there. Oh, there he goes, there he goes. Hoo -hoo. Not a big one. About 11 incher. But... I don't know which one he's on though. Okay, there he is. There he is. Got that on film for you. Let's get him over here and see which one he's on. He is on the, yeah, the dozen tail. Eh, 10, 11. Well, far, right from far. Uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh. I don't know why. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Let me show you. Uh, <laughs> oh. Come here. Tangled up here. There we go. Okay. There's the J bug still. That's kind of beaten up, but we'll let that go. And here's the new pheasant tail. That's a, this is a true 18, but it caught him. It's got a, this is a 102Y, I think a 102Y hook. It's an extra wide gap 18, but it doesn't have, it's still a regular size shank. So, um, Let's go down there again. Same spot, right in that pocket. Maybe. Okay, guys, got a decent one on here. Um, there is a decent amount of, um, gee, he is. Decent amount of sulfur's coming off now, but man, no surface activity. None. Oh, <laughs> just as I said, that one rose out there. But I'm pretty sure that was a caddish. That was a pretty splashy rise. So, this is a pretty decent fish right here. Looks like he's... I don't know. Oh, 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 oh. Man, he is... 
trying to keep him in. He looks like he's at least 14, 15. Okay. It's about 4.30, quarter to five right now. Yeah, this fish is really silver. Really silver. I would swear it's a rainbow. It's a little rambunctious like a rainbow, so... <laughs> I swear it's a rainbow. But you don't catch that many rainbows in the J. For me to catch two of them in one day would be... Look at that. Look at that. Another rainbow. Oh my gosh. Big. 14, 15. Oh my gosh. And I got him on my beadhead pheasant tail. <laughs> oh. Mm, 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 mm. All right. Russian. Like I say, you don't catch that many rainbows here on the J. For me to catch two of them in one day, that's, that's kind of different. Okay, there's my uh, beadhead pheasant tail. This one's got three lighter legs. It's got the uh, midge, mini midge legs, three of them. <laughs> okay, and then here is the opal caddis emerger I was talking about. Oh jeez, must have had one on that because that hook's open and I just put that on, that hook was not open. I know I had a hit out there earlier, but <laughs> I don't know why that hook would bend, but let me fix it. We'll be back. Hey guys, I'm finally switching over to dries. There's one rising out here. There's a ton of sulfurs coming down, but I really think he's taking caddis. But I'm just going to throw a sulfur at him anyhow to see if he takes it. Not there. A little too far. Up oh, there, see him? Boom. I'm a little bit outside, but let's see. Yeah. Get a little bit closer. Boom. Oh, one just rose right there. So let's see. I mean, if I had to put the caddis on, I will, but let's just go down and see. Boom. Oh, Ooh, well, I don't know what he took. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Come on. Probably taking the caddis. Oh, got him. He took the sulfur. Oh, oh, oh. He took the sulfur. <laughs> okay. Well, don't know if I called it right or if I just got lucky. <laughs> but either way, if you can't be right, it's, <laughs> it's okay to be lucky. <laughs> Okay, not a big one. Not a big, oh, there he goes. <laughs> he was about 11 inches. That's okay, I'll show you the sulfur. I got them on, it's a CDC sulfur. So, right there. And it's all wet now, it's all matted down. That's my sulfur, okay. Got a compare done. There he is, right there. 
He came up slow for that one. Let's see if he likes this. Oh. Oh, got him, got him. Oh, oh, he liked the Comparadon. Okay. First cast over him. Ha, ha. So. Was this a fluke? Or was I lucky? Or did I figure it out? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, nice fish. Nice fish. Okay. Okay. Get him up. Yeah, that's a nice fish. Come on, buddy. Oh. Get him over here. Now, with the dry fly fishing, I got 5X on. I gotta be a little careful now how I play them. I can't horse them. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. is just man. oh that train noisy 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 good probably 16 good 16 inches okay oh my gosh fat though super fat oh strong okay let me get this boy out of here okay let's see hey that compared guns right in his mouth Hoo -hoo. okay nice fish okay see nice 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 there you go. The Comparadon right in the mouth. Okay, let's get him out. Let's see if the Comparadon works on this boy over here. Okay, let's do a nice reach cast. Boom. Oh, he came up. Just as I was landing my fly. <laughs> let's try it again. Boom. Up a little higher. Right there, right there, right there, right there, right there. Right there. Oh, nope, okay. Let's try this again. Boom, not bad, not bad, not bad. Oh, man. Okay, come on, buddy. Where you at again? Boom, not bad. Oh, got him, got him. Got him, got him, got him. Said so the Comparadon's working. Yes. Yes, man, he's taking me out. That's the ticket. You gotta keep switching it up, looking for the right fly, guys. Okay, it's another nice fish. Come on, buddy. I think many guys use a comparadon around here. Big as the last one. This one's about, I don't know, 13, 14. 
Okay. 13. Okay. Got him, man. Ha ha. Better not go higher than right there. Okay. Bunker, dun dun. Okay. Let me clean this fly up and hopefully you'll get another one. There's one rising right over here. Let's see if we can put it in right. Oh, I can't see my fly. It's in the glare. Boom, that's good. That's good. Let it get down. Let it get down. Let it get down. Oh, I might have been over too far. Let's see. Oh, that's good. That's good. Go down. Go down. Go down. Oh, come on, buddy. There he is. I was way off. Okay, that's better. Right there. That's better. Oh, got him. Got him. There he goes. Yes, the Comparadon. He just sipped that under. He just sipped it under. Oh, he got off. That's what happens when you just sip it under. <laughs> okay, let me check my fly. Make sure it's okay. Okay, guys, I got two fish rising here. One straight below me. Oh, and then that one over there. Oh, and this one right here. <laughs> so... Let's see which one we can get. Let's do the first one right here. Oh man, he let that go. I put that right over his head. Boom. Actually, I might. Oh, there it is. I was off. Boom. That's it. That's not bad. There he goes. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Oh man, did I score good? With that comparison, this is the fourth one. The third one got off while I was fighting them. Okay. We'll get that boy. There's two here. Two or three right down here. Okay. Let's get this boy up here. Okay. This one's not bad. This one looks like it's about. 12, 13. Okay, let's get him up here. Come here, 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 come here. There you go. Nice. Beauty, beauty, beauty. Ha, 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 There you go. There you go. Ha, 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 Okay, okay. Guys. I got this one. There's two of them here. Two or three of them. I'm gonna go for the further one here first. Boom. Let's go over here. Let's get this boy. He's right out in front of this tree. Boom, that's it. That is it, right there. There, got him. Got him, got him, got him, got him. Got him, got him, got him. He's swimming up to me. He's swimming up to me. Put that cast right over his head and he sucked it right in. <laughs> I've had this fish on my line for like five minutes because I had to hook my battery up. <laughs> my battery went dead. So he's just been swimming around nonchalant. <laughs> Let me get him in. Caught him over near that tree. That boy just will get him after I get this guy in. So this is the fifth one on the Comparadon. Okay. Get him in. Let's get him in. I think he's about 12 inches. Okay. Good boy, good boy, good boy, good boy. Mm. He's about 13. Okay. Uh-huh. 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 U
Okay guys, I did my closing already, but there's two fish rising right here right before I get out. So let's see if I can pick them off. I, it's really a bad glare up there. I can't see my fly at all. So I'm just gonna see if I see a rise. I'll set the hook. Oh, that one's all the way up there. But there's one closer. Oh, got him. Oh, missed him. <laughs> got him. Missed him. I don't know if he even took my fly. I thought he did. I thought I saw my fly coming down to him. <laughs> Try it again. Uh, yeah, I see my fly now. It's past him. Boom. Coming down, coming down, coming down. Come on, buddy. Boom. Oh, that nice one up there rising. See if I can sneak up on him. This is an encore presentation. <laughs> Make sure. I gotta watch this tree here. Okay, where's he at? Where's he at? He's here somewhere. Man, that is a guy. There he is. Okay, here you go. Nice. Good 13 inches. Super de duper. Okay guys, that is my day on the Little J. We had a great day. Uh, we kind of caught fish throughout the whole day. I got here like 6 in the morning. It's around 6 o'clock at night. And maybe 6.30. And um, it wasn't hot and heavy any time other than at the end there when I figured out the uh, dries and what they were taking with the Caparadon. Um, and I caught like 5 on top. 5 or 6 on top. I think it was about 5 on top. Okay. And... Um, but other than that, we caught fish on nymphs, we caught fish on swinging wet flies in the morning, we caught fish on dries, we caught rainbows, we caught brownies. <laughs> so, it was a pretty good day overall. I had a lot of fish get off. Um, I don't know, maybe I landed total, I don't know, maybe around 15, 16 fish, and probably had about total of maybe, maybe nine, eight, nine, 10 fish at the most get off okay so uh, other than that it was a great day okay so um, sulfurs are still on they'll probably still be here for another you know throughout May and um, okay so guys oh my eyes my allergies are just killing me I <laughs> uh, hope you liked it give it a thumbs up if you like it look out for my uh, dry fly fishing video uh, that's coming out probably after this one and, um, okay. Thanks, guys. See you later. Bye.